There are questions tonight surrounding millions of debit and credit cards like this one. 13 Investigates has discovered a tiny device inside these cards that may be putting you at risk for fraud. Investigative reporter Bob Siegel shows you how to tell if your credit card is one of those affected and the simple steps you can take to protect yourself. Whether you're buying groceries or gas or dinner to go, nowadays you can just wave your card and you're on your way. It's the latest technology in millions of credit and debit cards, thanks to a tiny chip hidden inside. It's called RFID, Radio Frequency Identification. This little device sends out a radio signal with your credit card information. It's designed to be a faster way to pay at stores all over town. You know if you've got a credit card that's got radio frequency technology in it? Uh, no, I don't. Here's what to look for. A symbol similar to this one on your credit card or debit card, it's a sure sign it has radio frequency identification. If your card says pay pass, pay wave, or blink, it also has RFID. The nation's largest credit card companies all say radio frequency technology is very secure. Visa, MasterCard, and American Express sent statements to Eyewitness News. And all of them cite sophisticated fraud prevention, advanced capabilities, or powerful security to prevent misuse. And they say special safeguards mean even if crooks do intercept your credit card information, well, they can't do anything with it. With every new technology comes additional risk. Joan Antical is a security and privacy expert. She says it's not just credit cards that have radio frequency technology, but also passports and IDs used by many schools, private companies, and the government. Is this a real risk? Is this something we need to really worry about? I think it's a very big risk, actually. Over a billion cards have been issued with RFID chips in unencrypted form, uh, and all of those cards are very vulnerable to attack. What can you do to protect your credit card? Anything metal, even a piece of aluminum foil wrapped around your credit card? that'll block the radio signal and keep it safe from hackers. You can also tell your bank you don't want a credit card that has RFID. If you don't have a credit card with a radio chip in it, chances are you will soon. Right now, RF identification is in about a third of all credit cards, and that number is growing quickly. Want more information? Check out our website. We've got details on how to get a protective sleeve for your credit card like this one and what credit card companies want you to know about RFID technology. I'm Bob Siegel, Channel 13, Eyewitness News. And it's important to point out that radio chips aren't just in credit cards. Millions of debit cards that are connected directly to your savings and checking accounts have them as well. And tomorrow morning on Sunrise, Bob Siegel will discuss that threat.